got some bad news for you. If you're an avocado lover. If you're a millennial. Who loves avocado and toast. Prepare to cry yourself to sleep tonight. Your nation might be facing in the very near term a drastic avocado shortage. Meet your old can. Be a couple. The place where the United States gets eight out of ten avocados. Well, we had to ban it. And it's for a lot of different factors. One of which was they threatened a USDA worker recently. But they've been having some issues there on the ground locally in that area. The cartels have been threatening and harassing the avocado growers, distorting them, forcing them to well, give them money that they make for selling the avocados to the Americans. So there's no way around it. There's going to be a shortage. And the few avocados that are still in the market, they're going to go up drastically. Now, don't go and hoard avocados, please. Sharing is caring. Get you enough avocados for a week. And then leave some for other people. You know that some people are so greedy that the moment they hear shortage, they have to get all the avocados and leave none for nobody else. And that's what causes conflict. You see it all the time. You saw it with the toilet paper in 2020. Somebody would have their whole shopping cart full of all the toilet paper. There's no more in the store. And this individual, or the individuals that do this, they'll go and sell it online for a drastically marked up price. No. Take what you need with the avocados and leave the rest for somebody else. Let's not fight over avocados now. We all love avocados. This is going to be painful if you're a millennial. You grew up on avocados and toast. That's the quintessential millennial meal, breakfast, brunch, dinner, snack. Hopefully the market is back online soon. Hopefully. But I wanted to bring that news to you so you don't get shocked. And you don't see any avocados in the store. You don't think that well. You don't think the worst. You know, hopefully this situation and Mitchell Khan can get resolved. The cartels, you gotta leave the growers alone of the avocados. They already don't make that much money. It's not like the United States or any country that they sell the avocados to really pay them what the avocados are worth. No. So, this extortion of like small farmers, you gotta stop that. And to the consumers, the restaurants who use avocados. Try not to waste as much. You know, a lot of shit goes to waste. Now you gotta think about what you do 